guided meditation, it's going to be okay. Spoken by Lauren. In this guided meditation, we focus upon you simply feeling okay. This meditation is ideally suited to a simple relaxation helping you to prepare for sleep or perhaps in times of anxiety as a rescue remedy you know those times when life isn't flowing along really well and you need a little bit of a meditation cuddle <laughs> This is your meditation cuddle. Firstly, I'd like to welcome you to this guided meditation. I'd like to welcome you with open arms. This is your time, this is about you and this guided meditation is like an emotional day spa so that you can feel comforted, cared for and to allow yourself to heal through any experiences you've had. On this particular day. Before we start the meditation, I'd like you to turn off all the sounds and distractions that you have control over. Consciously turn down lights, consciously Turn off all the electrical devices that you can and consciously accept those sounds and distractions that you can't change. There are times when we may need to meditate while waiting in the car outside the school or perhaps taking time out from work and meditating just in our chair at work. Make a conscious decision to accept the sounds we cannot change. There is so much in life that we cannot change. We still have the power to choose our mindset. So let's today, right now, devote ourselves to our mindful health and well-being. Breathe slowly. Slow your breathing down, breathing in through the nose and out through the nose. I want you to find a position in which to meditate. This may be lying down or it may be seated. And we will start. Sit down or lie down comfortably and we will begin. Continue with the breath, breathing in through the nose and out through the nose. In through the nose and out through the nose. 
in through the nose and out through the nose. Slow your breathing down. Now we're going to try a couple of physical exercises before we move into a deeper sense of relaxation. And I want you to really devote yourself to these exercises. They're quite powerful and quite capable of changing our mindset. Remember, we choose our mindset. We choose how to feel. I'm not saying that it's easy, because it often is not easy, but it's still a conscious choice. And the more we practice meditation, the more power we have over our frame of mind. So we're going to try a couple of physical exercises. The first one is just wriggling your fingers and wriggling your toes. So be aware of the sensation of movement, how it feels to move. I'm going to count down from four, moving fingers and toes, and when I get down to one, we're going to, we're going to allow the fingers and toes to simply relax, let go. Four, moving fingers and toes. Three, wriggling fingers and toes. Two, really be aware of the movement. And one, let go. Let's try that one more time. So what we're trying to do here is get a clear contrast between movement and relaxation. The action or movement allows us to clearly contrast the difference between stillness, physical stillness and movement. So wriggle your fingers and toes, four, three, be aware of the movement, what does it feel like, the warmth, the flow of blood, three, two, and let go, let go. Breathe slowly. Breathe slowly. Slow your breathing down. Gently, softly, and with acceptance, be aware of your breath. I now want you to take your right hand and place your right hand in your left hand. So you are holding your own hand. Be aware of the sensation of touch between your right hand and your left hand. Humor me here and really explore this process and this experience. Your mind is infinitely powerful. How warm are your hands? What does the texture of skin feel like, skin to skin? Now, your right hand is the adult consciousness and your left hand is the inner child. I want you with your right hand to comfort the inner child. Comfort the inner child. Hold the hand of the inner child as you would hold a young child's hand that you are comforting, that you care for. Feel that hand. 
Hold it gently. Firmly with care. In your mind, think about the inner child. What feelings do you feel for the inner child? As the adult, it's important to feel a sense of reason and control that the care for the inner child is reasonable but not highly emotional. In order to care for someone else, we ourselves need to be in a place of wisdom. We ourselves need to be in a place of some maturity. So as the mature adult, care for the inner child. Explore the sensations of touch, care, consideration and empathy from a place of wisdom. In order to heal the inner child, the adult needs to be grounded the adult needs to be at peace. In order to comfort the inner child, the adult needs to be in a place of acceptance. Feel the hand of the inner child. We're going to breathe and continue with this exercise and explore it. Notice how the adult feels. Notice the environment, the conscious environment of the adult. Be the peaceful, tranquil adult, calming the inner child. Feel through the physical exercise, the textures of touch, Feel the warmth, feel comfort, breathe slowly. Let's sit in the silence for several breaths. Now as the adult, I want you to consciously send a message to the inner child. I want you to send the message to the inner child that he or she will be okay. Send the message, you are going to be okay. Now remember, in order for this to be effective, the adult needs to be in a place of tranquility. As a parent is when caring for a child. Send the message, you will be okay. You will be okay. Now I want you to imagine the inner child in one hand, bonding with the wise adult, the tranquil adult in the other hand. Imagine the bonding. So imagine a sphere coming together, a complete whole sphere. The one consciousness combining the inner child and 
the reasonable adult. They are now one. Using this image of the complete consciousness, the complete soul, no longer separated into adult and inner child. See the sphere of complete consciousness. Now I want you to take your hands and place them around yourself as if you're hugging yourself. So you Take your hands, I'm rubbing up and down my arms, you might be able to hear me touching my jumper. Up and down. Now, I want you to be aware that through your heart and mind you are one consciousness. Gently give yourself a hug. Remind yourself that you have infinite power. Of your own mindful self. I want you to feel a sense of comfort for yourself. Be aware of the feeling of touch. The feeling of being hugged. Hugs are incredibly healing. We can create that sensation of healing through hugging ourselves. And in that way we enhance our own power over our own mindful environment, our mindset. So feel that sensation of hugging yourself. Now you may want to rub your arms up and down your shoulders or just place your hands on both arms, cross both arms so you have that hug feeling. As you do so now, lengthen your spine. Relax your physical self and say to yourself, I'm okay. Breathe, I'm okay. Breathe, I'm going to be all right. Breathe slowly, I can do this. 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 I can do this, breathe slowly. I will do this, I will do this. So we're imagining achieving in life, achieving day-to-day -day engagement, love, forgiveness, tolerance, acceptance. I will do this, I can do this, I choose to do this. Now keep the virtual hug going gently. Breathe slowly so you're physically relaxed. And say to yourself, life may not always be easy. 
Sometimes life may throw me curveballs. Sometimes I may fall to my knees. But I can do this. I can get back up. I will get back up. I may take three steps forward and two back, but that's okay. I will get back up. I will keep going. I will be all right. I will be all right. It's going to be all right. Breathe slowly. 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 Now uncross your arms, or you can stop the virtual hug. Take the back of your hands and place them either on your thighs in a seated position or out slightly from your body so that you have a physical opening to the universe. Relax your fingers. Palms out and say to yourself, I accept what the universe offers me. But my acceptance is not apathy. My acceptance is a gentle decision to be myself, to love myself, to forgive myself, to tolerate others, to forgive others, to feel kindness, empathy, and love. Breathe slowly now. Let's sit in the stillness. Experience the stillness. What does it mean to experience stillness? Relax your face. Head, the muscles, many muscles in the head. Lengthen the spine and the neck. Sit in the stillness. It's going to be okay. Relax the legs. It's going to be okay. Relax the arms. It's going to be okay. Relax the hips. It's going to be okay. Relax now. As you listen to my voice, you feel yourself relaxing. It's going to be okay. Relax. It's going to be okay. Relax. 
it's going to be okay. Relax. It's going to be okay. I'm okay. It's going to be okay. It's going to be It's going to be okay. 